I developed a burning sensation in my chest. And it spread across my shoulders. I never entered my thought that I would ever have a heart problem or heart disease. We, we were both really surprised that he had that blockage. I was really not wanting anything to be wrong with me. I wanted to be normal. It was very frightening. She lets me know that uh, she doesn't want to lose me. I don't know what I'd do without him. And I don't want to lose her. In the past, uh, I didn't like going to a doctor. But now, I see where it's very important that you let your doctor know what's going on in your life. It's extremely important to be open and honest with your cardiologist. I think it's very important for us as physicians to stop talking and listen. A few years ago, I noticed that my activity level had diminished. I would have tightness in my chest. I was always gasping for air. As that pain moved up into my neck and jaw, it hit me, oh my gosh, this is not my indigestion. Francis' chief complaint was mid upper gastric chest discomfort. What we see is a stent, which appears to be widely patent, and yet Francis is continuing to have chest pain. Based upon Robert's chest pressure and mild shortness of breath with certain activities, his physical examination, and the result of a stress test, my diagnosis was chronic angina. Some patients may worry that they'll offend their doctors when seeking a second opinion, but they need to remember that doctors went into medicine to take care of patients and help them. Second opinions help all of us. We want to identify the advanced or aggressive disease as early as possible. The one of most concern for the patient is the one called cancer. It's a life-altering and perhaps a life-threatening diagnosis. Why would you not want to be sure that that diagnosis is correct? Dyslexia is not a disease, but a different organization of a brain that is ripe to invent, design, and create if we give it that environment. It's okay to be different. I'm different from all the kids. I see things and I make a new thing out of it. Because creativity is a very powerful and special thing. You don't just get it, you earn it. It's a gift. I developed this shortness of breath. I could not walk very far. And I went so far downhill that I couldn't cross the street. I couldn't cross Washington Square Park. I basically couldn't walk. And I thought, oh my God, I can't breathe. Yo me daba cuenta que no podía hacer mis labores diarias como antes. Me sentía muy mal. Nosotros latinos tenemos la costumbre de entrar con el doctor y nomás escucharlo. Le tenemos miedo. No le tengan miedo, hablen con él. And I said, oh, I think they finally got it. I'm feeling better. I can concentrate on my future. I'm back to the old Teddy again.